can't, Night Moon. It's the middle of nowhere. Hey, can't nowhere. We're here. Is there something wrong with the bus? Is there anything I can help you with? So somebody's coming to get us, right? Kind of psycho. No one's ever gonna find us out here. Quit being such a baby. Hey, keep cool, you guys. <gasps> what was that? Be back. What is it? Ah! Don't run. Just eat again. Technology freaks them out every time. Hi, I'm Uncle Al. Uncle Al? Uncle Al? The camp director. Oh. Uh, sorry about the welcoming committee there. We get a lot of wildlife up here. It keeps you on your toes. What was it? That was Saber. Who's Saber? Now, Saber is not a who. It's an it. Just keep to the trails and it won't bother you. Okay, grab your duffels. Let's go. We got a mile walk in. Oh. Yeah. I usually spend my summers with my relatives. My parents go out of town a lot. <laughs> what do they do? Rob Banks? <laughs> oh, <come on. laughs> I wonder <Jay>. who. <laughs> no, they're scientists. They go on these field trips. That's the drag. Nah. I'm kinda used to it. At least this is better than spending summer with my boring aunt and uncle. My parents checked out a whole lot of camp. Night Moon's supposed to be the best. Yeah. It's gonna be cool. My name's Don. I'm Billy. Okay, girls, listen up. Your camp is a half a mile down this path. Uh, Mrs. Martha, your counselor. Let's go. Hustle up. Careful on the trail. Careful. We don't want anyone spraining an ankle on the first day. Okay, fellas. Follow me. Boys, welcome to Camp Night Moon. Before I assign you to your bunk, I'd like to lay down a few rules. One, no leaving your bunks at night and sneaking out anywhere. Who would do such a thing? Two, the girls' camp is completely out of bounds. Girls are not part of this program. Good. I forgot my deodorant. <laughs> Rule three. Lights out at nine. Wake up at six. My last rule, and maybe the most important one of all, you write home to your parents every day. Every day. Okay, that's it. You guys follow my rules, and you're going to have the best time of your lives. Yeah. Right. What's that, Uncle Al? The forbidden bunk. Why is it called the forbidden bunk? Because it's forbidden. So stay clear. Any other questions? Okay, let's get you guys settled in. Campfire is at 1900 hours. All right. I'm supposed to sleep in here? Who's gonna sleep anyway? We're gonna stay up all night. Ah, whether we like it or not. 
Hey, look! Cookies from Mom? Actually, from Daddy. Help yourself. Mm. Thanks. Hey, who's this Saber? Nobody knows much about it, but I heard he got two kids last summer. <laughs> You're joking, right? Oh! 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 What's the matter, Mike? Not enough chips in your cookies? Oh! <laughs> to a doctor or a nurse or something, aren't you? Hang in there, Mike, okay? Stay calm. Come on. Okay, who threw the sheet out the window? He did. You're the counselor? Uh, the name's Larry. Hey, Larry, we gotta get this guy to a nurse. Why'd you throw a perfectly clean sheet out the window? And there was a snake in it. A snake! It bit Mike. Oh. Oh, man. Get that out of my face. I just ate. Go wash it off. I think maybe I got a bandage. Hey. Uh, a bandage? Uh, well, we gotta get the poison out. We gotta do something. You think you know more than me? Now, the rest of you guys get ready. We got campfire at 1900. I wanna see the nurse. What nurse? There's no nurse? No. What do you think? Uncle Al runs a camp for wimps? Now, wash the baby's arm, then wrap it. It'll be fine. Night moon, oh night moon, our hearts are full of pride. Night moon, oh night moon, a while will be our guide. Cobblers and winders, they are not welcome here. Night moon for big guys, there is no place for beer. any mustard. I'm really hungry anyway. How's your hand? It's not just my hand anymore. I'm numb up and down my whole side. You should be in the hospital. Hey! What's your name, son? Billy? You were talking during the camp song, Billy. No. That's not allowed here. What's so important? Mike's arm's all swollen up. I think you should see a doctor. A doctor? Snake bit me. Who's your counselor, son? Larry. Larry, why wasn't I told about this? Yeah, Larry, why wasn't I told? Let me see that, son. Ow! Good. That's good. You still have feeling in it. But it really hurts. I know. I've been running this camp for 23 years, and I've seen all sorts of bites. This is really nothing to worry about. Told you, wimp. <laughs> I promise you, the swelling and the pain will be gone by morning. Really? <laughs> Trust me. I embarrassed Billy a minute ago when all he was trying to do was help a friend. Now, looking out for each other is what Camp Night Moon is all about. And that makes Billy number one camper in my books tonight. Yeah. Three cheers for Billy! Hooray! 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 Yeah, okay. I think I could eat something. Oh, hey, hey, listen. I, uh, I got a marshmallow. <laughs> I just picked that up on the trail. 
Look, guys, there it is. The forbidden bunk. We gotta check that baby out. You in? I don't know. Maybe. Don't tell me the number one camper is chicken. <laughs> I'm not a chicken. Hey, hey. Maybe the number one's afraid of doing a number. Hey. Not it. I just <laughs> don't think it's a good idea. That's all. trying to be a downer. It just really hurts. Where's Mike? Maybe he's out picking marshmallows. <laughs> There's no blankets on his bed. He probably ate them. <laughs> ate them. <laughs> hey, look at this. This stuff's gone too. Hey, what'd they do with them? Mike? Mike! We want to see the nurse. It really hurts. Mike? Better get your silly hides down to the lodge. Where's Larry? We got a missing camper. I gotta talk to him. Larry's eating breakfast. He sent me over here to get you guys. If you got a problem, you take it out with him. Now get going. If it isn't the little Eagle Scout. Why aren't you guys at your table? Where's Mike? Go back to your table. This one's for counselors only. Is he okay? Yeah, his stuff's gone. Did Uncle Al send him home? Yeah. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> Forget it, Billy. Let's go home. Look, I want to find out what happened to Mike. Geez, Larry, you got a bunch of whiners this summer? Where is he, Larry? Mike's not here, Billy. So I guess maybe he's somewhere else. Satisfied? Uncle Al must have sent him home. I mean, his hand was pretty swollen. Yeah, well, then how come Larry won't tell us what's going on? Counselors aren't supposed to talk about that stuff. Yeah? He might give his poor little kids nightmares, huh? Okay, you guys, get your faces out of your bowls and listen up. Who's for a serious game of baseball? Yeah! Well, let's go! Come on, Billy. Guys, bad news. Forget about it. Come on, let's play some ball. Go, Billy! Go, 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 go! Sid! Yeah! Cut her up! Hey, Billy, oh, right. let's play ball! Oh, Billy. Let's go! Come on, Billy! Hey. What are you doing? Let's go! Let's Come on, go. Billy, batter up! Do you know what happened to Mike, Uncle Al? Mike? Which one's Mike? Last night, snake bite? Oh, yeah, yeah, the blonde kid. Yeah. Just you play ball, son. Okay? Don't make mountains out of molehills. You're here to have fun, so start having it. Come on, we need a hitter. Play ball. Step in, Billy. Let's go! 
Come on, Billy. I'm going to strike you out. Come on, Billy, get me out of here. Hit me home. Bring him home. Oh, yeah. yeah. Go, go, go. Run. Run, Billy. Go, third, go, go, go. You're out of here. You're out of your mind. Safe by a mile. Safe at third. <laughs> what? You beat the throw, Larry. Now play ball. Larry. Batter up. All right, here we go. Come on, man. The guy was running on the baseline. Well, it slipped out of my hand, Uncle Al. It's all right, Larry. It's not your fault. What's the kid's name? Colin. Maybe he's got a concussion or something. He should get some help. Nah. You're all right. Come on. Uh, uh, you're okay. Come on, tough it out. Uh, Take him to the lodge, Billy, and ice down this lump. Uh, then they want the both of you to get to the flagpole, pronto. Uh, <laughs> You've got some tents to set up. Tonight, is survival night. Better, uh, a major night mood tradition where each night a different bunk gets to sleep under the stars. Live off the land. Bunk four, you're up first. <laughs> Dear Mom and Dad, I miss you a lot. Hope you're okay. I'm all right, but there's something strange about this camp. Weird things have been happening. My counselor Larry's a real jerk. Mm -hmm. But Uncle Al, the camp director, seems like an okay guy. Maybe it's just me. Maybe I'm just a little nervous. First time at camp and all. Mm -hmm. I hope your work is going well. I love you both. Billy. Billy! Oh, man. Oh, man. Get that out of my face. It's awesome out there. Come on, Billy. Let's break some rules. The forbidden bunk. Go away to you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you guys aren't really going up there, are you? Come on, man. It's a perfect night. We can't just leave him. You guys go ahead. He's fine, man. Come on. Mm hmm. Nah, I think I'm gonna stay. Oh, whatever. Let's go, let's go. Yeah, come on. Other guys, we gotta get Colin. No, forget it, man. We got to get to our boat. You do what you want. Billy! Colin, get out of there. Saber's coming. Come on, man. We gotta go. Saber's hungry. Help me. Uh, go. Come on. Yes, go, 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 go. Hurry. Uh, Come on. Go, go, go. Now, this is how I'd like you to read it. I understand. I say, Life with Louie is on every Saturday morning on Fox Kids. You're talking to Louie's dad, an old army vet that knows how to take orders. Now, listen up. Watch an all-new Life with Louie Saturday on Fox Kids. And remember, I'm in charge. Yeah, that's right. Good job.